And welcome back to more Paper Mario. Last time we found out the location of the Invisible Top of Blubba in Gusty Gulch, and unlike what I said last time, this time we will not be going into Forever Forest, we will be going back into Toad Town. Slight detour, because this is kind of important to show. Actually not too important, I just want to show it anyway. This is a warp pipe. <laughs> Duh. I don't know why I needed to say that, but okay, this is private, but what does that mean? And of course, because Mario has no sense of privacy, he'll go there anyway. Break this block, go in here, and this is a really moldy looking Goomba. <laughs> um, gonna ignore him for just a little bit. Gonna switch to Goombario here, I have my reasons. Blooper! Well, that guy's not that impressive, actually. Um, I was expecting a little more. I mean, if you played Thousand Your Door. Oops. <laughs> I meant to put uh, Z, not that. This is a blooper. Bloopers lurk in the dank pools of Toe Town Tunnels. Max HP 30, attack power 3, defense power 0. It's so pretty unremarkable. Uh, also, you have to wonder how they flow in the air like that. Age old question, and the answer is Nintendo logic. Uh, quite simply. Uh, I don't have the jump upgrade, I have the hammer upgrade, so. Wow, this is actually going well. Um, I got capped, I think, but hey, 10 damage isn't bad on first turn. Uh, that only hurts Mario, oddly enough. It doesn't hurt Goombario, not that I'm complaining, because, well, I don't want my partner out for that many turns, and just for the sake of Oh, actually this is dumb, I need to switch out. Um, and that attack is- I'm not even gonna bother blocking it, to be honest. <clears throat> so, uh, of our partners. Uh, oh, my phone just went off, I was just checking. Of our partners, Paracarry is our best partner. Um, it's 6 damage, see that was totally worth this turn, taking off a turn to switch. Um, 3 FP as well, really nice. Power Bounce, I could finish it off with Power Bounce, but um, there's another boss right after this. Actually, I'll go heal after this, uh, so it's, I could have just used Power Bounce. I'm trying to get better at Power Bouncing because that is the optimal strategy most of the time. But I tend to avoid it like the plague, so I'll well, give it a shot. Concentration mode, activate. I know he's dead, but I just want to see how long I can go. I got, yeah, when Mario get, like jumps back to a starting position, that means you get capped. If he just falls straight to the ground, that means you mess up the action command. So, good to know. <clears throat> Shrink Stomp lowers enemy attack, but I never use Shrink Stomp. I used it in like practice, not practice, in like previous playthroughs and it's not good. <laughs> um, okay, we can, since that was so short, we can say hi to these guys while we're here. This is a spiked Goomba, there's spiked Goombas who live in the Toad Town Tunnels. So they're a lot stronger, but at the same time we do have the upgraded hammer, so... It should be able to do 4 HP of damage, which isn't too bad. Problem is, they're high attack with that. But, we can also show off our new move. And just pray to stars that this actually works. Get it, because it's a star. <laughs> okay, that probably didn't need explaining. But, oh shoot, only one fell asleep, that's actually not good. Um, well, bet. <laughs> Save us, please. Um, and not block that, that is not good. Um, so our other remaining FP, not FP, SP, we'll be using to heal. Um, I'm gonna go back to Toad Hunt in any way, so might as well just flush HP and FP as much as possible, just to survive. Um, Power Bomb is actually a really good move against these guys, because, well, just look at those damage numbers, that's self-explanatory. Um, back and quit hell <laughs> already. Um, and I'll finish it. So we're going back to the sur Oh, Merle. Uh, we will not have to go back. After all. So we leveled up and we get full restore. I don't think this actually applies to the Japanese version, only the English version. 
stat where you get an actual heal from this, so something to keep in mind. But we're not gonna fight that Goomba, and I have my reasons. We are going to tell him after this, but um, there's something that kind of takes priority. This we can't do anything about. It's like the floor panel in Mario's house. We have to come back in a little bit. By a little bit, I mean like two episodes from now. We'll do massive backtracking. Um, <clears throat> this is yet another blooper. This is the super bloop. No, electro blooper. Uh, this is an electro blooper. Electro bloopers are electro charge. Max HP 50, so this guy's a little more of a badass, I guess you could say. Um, if you can dodge electricity, uh, that is a hint to something we don't even have, so that's not good, to be honest. Um, power bounce, try to get the timing. I shouldn't have done this one yet, actually. I should have come back later. Oh well. Um, I'm getting better with the power bounces. Um, 11 damage, that's pretty good. We have nothing to worry about then. Hopefully. Um, <clears throat> keep that Mario. Okay, me, because I'm actually controlling Mario. Um, oh shoot. <laughs> that was not as good of a power bounce. Uh, pair carry. Oh man. I would have liked to level up after this fight to be fair, but um, I am criminally underprepared for this fight. <clears throat> We're gonna take six damage, but that's okay because we uh, I have a plan. Wait, he's just gonna do that? Oh, maybe I disrupted his electricity because I attacked him. Uh, if that's actually the case, then okay, I'll take it, but I have no clue if that's actually what happened, because, again, I'm not like an expert on Paper Mario, I know more about Thousand Year Door, comparably, but, um, yeah, I've only played this game like three times through, <laughs> it sounds probably like a lot, but it is actually not a lot. Uh, to be honest, I just want to get this out of the way. It also disrupts his electricity. Besides, the dust hammers would sing at inventory forever. Just collecting dust. <laughs> like my, like my um, PS2. <clears throat> I'm actually thinking about dragging out the old thing and actually doing a LP with that, actually. Um, gasp, me playing a non-Nintendo game for my channel? I, <laughs> uh, I, if people are okay with it, I, I'd actually like doing that, but again, I don't know if people would be okay with that or not. <clears throat> I'm just gonna flush the tri shroom just because... <laughs> I like how Mario's like, gross. Dude, uh, this is gonna hurt Paracarry more than it hurts him, I think. Oh, actually... <laughs> uh, okay, so I'm glad I did that, because... Um, it actually worked out. So got a switch here, and hit that, and boom. Not boom, boom. Uh, four pipes, but we have unfinished business in the other room. And I did not. I wanted to be at full health in that fight, just because it can be a little challenging for a strike. I should have used the hammer. I'm dumb. Um, Gubario is the weakest party member, but because of my whole tattle strategy, that might not have been the best. The best idea. Probably should have gone with a little para carry. Uh, I mean, um, oh, actually, thanks, Merly. <laughs> Again, one times when Merly actually helps. Sort of like the old joke about, um, you only get critical hits in Pokemon when you they have no health anyway. Um... <clears throat> uh, that's not... I don't know if that's part of the LP curse, or just in general. <laughs> um... In fact, I've never caught shiny Pokemon. Uh, if I LP poke, uh, Fire Red like I was thinking about, I'll probably just cast, a, cast them... Catch them in droves, just because of bad luck weird luck, the file I'm not even going to use like, super competitively, of course I'll just get a ton of them. Um, sleep cheap, don't need that. These blocks respawn and also don't have anything important. That was the one the Gloomba was on. Oh, I take that back. Um, super Shroom, I'll take it. I'll probably stash it actually. Um, no wait, actually the next area is kind of tough. Not like uber tough, but I'm actually hesitant about going forward because I don't know where the next blooper is to be honest. Um, there are a couple down in the sewers. I hope there's a. Huh? 
I don't even know what this is. Uh, and like, I'll probably accidentally trigger a blueprint and get crushed by accident. Um, uh huh. I could use para carry. I might as well just get the sewers out of the way as much as we can now. Save time later. Let's see. Um, this is our piece. That's a Paragloomba, but we are not in any ship be fighting him right now. Um, nor are we in any ship fighting more Spike Kalumbas, so we're just gonna run like heck. <laughs> um, you know what? We're so low on health, I think we're gonna call it a day. Not gonna risk it and risk it, as they say. Actually, there is one cool secret. And it's not this room, actually, so forget I said anything. Okay. There's war pipes. Well, that is a brilliant observation, yet again. This goes to Goomba Village. Might as well just heal up now, because we're in the neighborhood, literally. Oh, we gotta talk to this guy. Um, I'll check mail and stuff later. Uh, we have a big opportunity to do that. Coming up after the Forever Forest. Just, well, take care now. Um, Oh, Chuck Wizmo. Howdy. Um, Kawiz. Just same dialogue every time, don't bother. Um, I like if you're in a hurry, you don't have to read it. Oh, wait, there's a Yoshi, I didn't notice that. And Luigi is in the audience. What's the color of the first block you break with a hammer? That is yellow. These questions are RNG, but um, they're capped, I think, where you can't get a question for something you haven't seen yet. Um, like, you can get ran you get random questions, but basically, um, certain ones obviously are set to not appear when you can't even know they exist, obviously. That goes without saying. Boom. Koopa Village. Um, I just want to see what the first quest is here. Oh, welcome, young fellow. I'm the elder of Koopa Village. Folks call me Koopa Koop. Say, might you do me a favor? Sure. Um... Koopa Legends of Colorado. So, um, basically, okay, I'll take this time to end off the video. I'll be explaining the side quest. Um, basically, Koopa Koop will ask you for favors, and you do the favors. That is as easy as it gets. Is Bob on. Oh, wait, why am I reading this? <laughs> uh, which is actually, this is hilarious. Um, <laughs> he's not with Bombat, but she doesn't uh, she doesn't like him because he's so persistent. Love is complicated. <laughs> yeah, that blue bob on him apparently has an epic crush on Bombat, but she isn't having any of it, so we can just go into Colorado's back room here. No problem. I don't know if there's anything in there, but Mario, you don't believe my husband. He came home out of the blue the other day and he's already left again. Off with some fool's hair and fool's air and not herring. <laughs> um you need something, you're doing an errand for the elf? That's what I meant by errand. Herring. Uh, never mind. Um, let, let the. Wrong button again. Don't let that old coot work you too hard, okay, Mario? So don't do that. He's also a bit short tempered. Well, anyway, wait here for just a moment. I'll go poke around the house for the Um, that is foreshadowing. <laughs> You'll see why in a moment. You're talking about this book, right? It's all yours. It was behind the bookshelf. The Koopa Legends. Um, for, uh, what? <laughs> Koopa Legends? Is, it's a fitness? Okay, whatever. Not gonna judge. Here's the kicker about Koopa Koop. You'll see in a moment. Great Galba Goombas, you're a lifesaver, Mario. This is just what I needed. Uh, okay. To show my gratitude, I'd like to make a gift of this. Oh, don't be so polite, young fellow. Take this. Yes, you normally get one coin for these side quests. Which is why I'm going to save them in bulk because they are so useless that I want to do them all in a block so it's like, oh, you can skip, you can skip the video, <laughs> make the video completely expendable. But I just wanted to explain that's why. And this pipe goes to Tri Tri Desert, if you can tell. Um, no, not Tri Tri Desert, Tri Tri Outpost. Um, that's all we can do here, or all I want to do. 
Uh, we'll cut back to that wooden panel over there in just a little, little bit. Um, but with that out of the way, we can safely head back to Forever Forest. And I know I'm missing some stuff, but it's not worth doing it spread out that way. So next time on Paper Mario, we'll be entering Forever Forest.